Welcome back to Mountain Connections. There is a new series on Animal Planet called Saved by the Barn. This I'm is about a family. farm that rescues farm animals that have been abused or neglected, and it premieres on Saturday night. Here's more. I'm here with Dan McCurran. He left his six-figure job to follow his heart and passion, which is starting a rescue for farm animals that have been abused and neglected. He's telling and to tell us more about his series, Saved by the Barn. Thanks for joining us, Dan. Hi, thank you for having me. So tell me a little bit about your journey and how you found yourself where you are today. Oh, man. Yeah, it was quite the journey. Uh, <laughs> So I was living in Austin, Texas, working a tech job as a developer, um, and that was my life. Uh, I was staring, I was glued to my computer screen for you know 16 hours a day, and then out of the blue, my dad gave me a call and asked me what we should do with the family farm that's been in the family for over 140 years, located in uh, Michigan, and uh, you know, I've always loved animals. I know my grandmother does too, my dad does, and I wanted to do something special. And I decided to start a farm animal sanctuary for farm animals specifically. And how do you go about rescuing these animals? Are the owners willing to give you these animals? Do you sometimes have to um, kind of have some confrontations with the <laughs> owners in order to provide a better life for these animals? Yeah, no, there is uh, definitely, there are cruelty cases when we do work with law enforcement. I just got my animal control license, so I can, you know, work very closely with law enforcement. Um, but there are uh, owner surrenders. Uh, for instance, Mike the cow, he was going blind and the farmer didn't want to put him down. Um, he wanted to uh, give him to us, so he has the best possibility of living a normal life. And so... Mike was going blind, and I drove him all the way out to California. We spent two weeks in the van together. It was definitely unique. It was smelly. Um, but, uh, you know, I took him to Malibu, uh, tried to make all these cool experiences for him, treated him just like anyone would treat their best friend, uh, you know, their dog. So, uh, sadly, it didn't work out, but that was like uh, one instance of how these cases come to us. Or, you know, sometimes we just get Facebook messages. Um, so it's, 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 each rescue is truly unique. I am not kidding you. <laughs> oh, I, I bet. And how did your efforts become this new Animal Planet series, Saved by the Barn? Yeah, uh, well, social media, I believe. Uh, I would, uh, document everything I was doing, uh, the interactions I had with all these farm animals, um, because I didn't grow up with farm animals, so... When I'm laying in a pasture and a cow lays her head on my shoulder, that's the first time I've ever experienced that. And you can kind of see the joy that is on my face. And so being able to tell their unique stories really caught uh, animal plants uh, attention. And uh, I think they really want to be able to uh, put a good smile on everyone's face, definitely during these hard times. Um, and I'm, it's gonna, if, if families are looking for something new to watch this is going to put such a good smile on your face. I'm definitely looking forward to watching it. I know my family is going to absolutely adore it. Without giving too much away, is there a rescue that really stands out in your mind that you can mention? Yes. I mean, right right off the bat, when uh, the show premieres on Saturday, Ginger the Lamb, I, she is absolutely adorable. Uh, she is oh just a fluff ball and I love her um but she has had such an uphill battle she had leg deformities and she was blind and so you get to follow her journey of uh becoming a normal lamb here on the farm so that she can live uh, a normal long life and again I'm just very much looking forward to watching this and you're right what a great time to see some heartwarming stories working yeah. with more information about the series and about your efforts Definitely. Uh, you can uh, look us up at uh, barnsanctuary.org or you can go to the Animal Planet website. We are going to be premiering at 10 p.m. Uh, Eastern and 9 p.m. Central this Saturday. Uh, if you can't make it, please record it. It's going to be, you're going to love it. I, I know we will. I'm definitely looking forward to <laughs> seeing this and seeing you in action. It's great talking Thank with you, Dan. Good luck with everything. And, again, just can't wait to see this series called Saved by the Barn on Animal Planet. Thank you so much.